some of the single-use medical tests, called lateral flow tests, were created with discarded chewing gum. Researchers in Scotland are turning to the chewy treat and other recycled materials in hopes of making a dent in a huge plastic waste problem. Every year, billions of lateral flow tests, or LFTs, are used globally to test for illnesses like COVID and malaria, and also for conditions like pregnancy. Not only are they simply thrown away after a single use, but they're also made of virgin plastic material. What we're asking here is, do they have to be made out of virgin plastic? Could we remove the carbon footprints of the virgin plastic production in this specific use case? Nearly 18,000 tons of plastics are produced for rapid LFT testing every year, with an average test containing up to 15 grams of single-use virgin plastic. That's according to Maywen Kursadi Kurhoas, a researcher and professor at Scotland's Harriet Watt University. In partnership with the firm Great Central Plastics, her research team has produced five prototype devices made from a range of recycled materials, including chewing gum. What we're hoping is that uh, through uh, the use of these cassettes, we can promote a debate on the regulations, on the economics, on the customer acceptance of these new materials, and ultimately uh, save 30 to 50% of the carbon footprint uh, of the virgin material production. Currently, very few plastics used in medical testing are recycled because of issues due to sorting and potential contamination. So, most are incinerated or sent to a landfill. Alice Street, a professor at the University of Edinburgh, says it's an urgent issue to address. Really, this is the challenge of modern healthcare, that in order to save lives and improve health, we are producing huge numbers of single-use plastic devices, but those same devices are also contributing to a growing burden of plastic pollution globally. We need not only healthcare systems that will contribute to growth and to health, we also need healthcare systems that are themselves healthy. Chiron Phillips of Great Central Plastics says the team has the machinery and knowledge to shift the industry's mindset. There are many professionals within the UK that would be able to embark on this challenge and move into a more sustainable option on products like this. As well as used chewing gum, the team has also developed LFTs using four other sustainably derived plastics, such as old fridge parts. They now have approval to test their prototypes to make sure they function just as well as existing LFTs. Mm -hmm.